Hi guys, welcome. I made this quick video to show you how to easily and quickly transfer your iMovie project files or raw files from a, a mobile device such as an iPhone or an iPad to your desktop or laptop, in this case to my MacBook. It's very simple, it only takes a couple of steps to do so. I generally start my, uh, or most often start my iMovie projects on my iPad or iPhone and then I would move it on to my uh, MacBook uh, to continue editing. I just find that working on a larger screen is better for my eyes. So before we get started, please, if you're new to my channel, uh, hit that subscribe button as well as that bell icon to be notified of more videos coming up soon. And if you like this uh, video to uh, hit that like button. For the purpose of this video, we're going to use AirDrop. Uh, if you don't have AirDrop, that's fine. You can use iCloud. It'll give you the same options. So here is the app on my, um, on my iPhone. I'm just going to open it up. I'm going to select the project and then I'm going to use the share button. And now this is the important bit here the uh, options. I'm going to click on options. Now it'll always default uh, to um, video. Video is generally uh, the, um, the default uh, option and it's the end product. You don't want that because it's non-editable uh, files. So you need to choose project. Now this will send uh, the project files that and so you can continue editing uh, on your uh, uh, desktop or laptop. Click done, choose airdrop, and now I'm going to choose my um, MacBook. And you can see there it's now on, on, on my MacBook there. And uh, I'm just going to select accept, and there it is there. And then to open it, I can double click or right click and send to iMovie. And that's it guys, simple as that, it's a few steps to transfer your uh, iMovie working files from your mobile devices to your desktop or laptop. Or you can even transfer between mobile devices such as iPhone to iPad, iPad to iPhone. That's it guys, I uh, hope you got something out of that. Uh, please feel free to comment below with any suggestions or feedback. I'm always happy to hear from you and I will do my very best to answer your questions or any um any queries you may have and again like I said if you liked uh, this video please hit that like button and uh, thanks for watching